What's the password? Can I come in? Nah, that ain't it. Hey, groovy guys and gals, welcome back to a toy car case event at Johnny Roman's Supper Club. It is 316 on old Johnny Clock. Let's see what pulled into our parking lot. Oh, we've got a bunch more new cars off the pegs. We still got a bunch of old stuff from flea markets and thrift stores and gifts that we still got to go through, which are really cool. And even some more peg finds after these. So let's check these out. There's some really cool ones in here. Hey cats and kittens, it's a toy car case event at Johnny Roman Supper Club. It is 316 on old Johnny Clock. Let's see what pulled into our parking lot. Oh, these are so much fun to find. Some of the newer stuff. Now, let me tell you, old Johnny probably leaves a lot of treasure hunts behind because I have no idea what I'm looking for. Sometimes I know what I'm looking for and sometimes I don't. Like these. I know these come in a treasure hunt, but not these two. <laughs> this one's a really cool VW. Coffer eraser. Look at that. Now, I know we've seen this a billion times online and throughout everything. This is the Contoured Series, number five of five. But there is a treasure hunt out there. The TH is right up here on the back deck. If you're lucky enough to find one. I have not found one yet. This is a Nissan Skyline 2000 GTRB LBJWK LLLMNOP. There it is. Again, this one is part of the Japan series, the imports, and let me tell you, very cool design. Simplistic, gorgeous colors. Now they could have detailed up that back end a little bit more, but they did not. I'm loving this one, white and orange. It's 67 Ford GT40 MK4. Is that nice? This is a retro racer, four of ten. Look at that. So gorgeous. If you don't have this one, look for it again. Detail that back end, maybe buy two, keep one in the package, and detail the life out of the next. Now here's a GT17 a GT Ford. This is the new model. So you've got old and new and this is part of the turbo series right again it's fun to see these cars side by side then here's a 2020 Jaguar F-type now this is a super treasure hunt not this one but if it has a TH right here on this first front quarter panel it's a super treasure hunt it's a goldie goldie. I was lucky enough to find one of those. It was a miracle. Crazy, crazy. Here's a Camaro IROC Z. Look at this, 85. Again, muscle mania from last year, but gorgeous. Again, if you don't like the tampo on this, Mr. Dry Erase Marker takes that off and you could have whatever you want on there. How's your hand painting job on that? Here's a Baja Bone Shaker, which is pretty sweet. Now this one came in red and a darker color. I can't remember if it was green or black. Baja Racers, two of 10. Look at that, fun stuff. Here's another Bone Shaker from the Dream Garage from this year. Now we've, I think I showed you this one. Maybe it was in a reel on Instagram. But this one, very cool. Then I was lucky enough to find a moon version of the Bone Shaker from last year, which was really nice. This was sitting on the shelf. And again, as these stores started to get cars in, this is the Rod Squad. 
they started getting cars in again. Well, they were cases from last year that had been sitting somewhere on dry dock or something. Here's the 2020 Corvette. So some of these old cars are coming out and you got a chance at getting something from last year. Look at that. Very nice. This is an Acura NSX. Look at this. 90. And a Tribute car. Very cool. Maybe he had one of these. Oh, this is before they put an actual logo on the car. So this is last year's Exotics. So... Another 2020 Corvette, which is nice. Factory Fresh, 3 of 10. We got two of those. Here's the Volvo 850 Estate Wagon. Look at that. Green, just gorgeous. Simple, easy, but a gorgeous representation. If you're a station wagon lover, like charlie from big charlie's garage here's the mazda rx3 again this color combo on this car it does it for me imports j imports so that is pretty sweet Then look at this, a Dodge Charger. Kind of mudded up, Baja Blazer style. Spare tires in the back. I know some of you guys are gonna wheel swap this down to normal wheels and take that back end and straighten it out and just make a regular charger. This is from the Fast and Furious series, which is pretty sweet. Let's see what else we got here. Oh. It's a Cadillac. Come on. ATS VR 16. Kind of a little sporty, racy Cadillac. This ain't a 59 Cadillac convertible like old Johnny wants. And then this is another one that is left on the on the shelf a lot this is a big air bel air in black kind of wild ride chevy bel air on this side from this year five of five what did he say he said he loves Johnny Roman's Supper Club's Countdown. <laughs> Hosting the toy car case event for the adult die cast collector. That guy needs a sedative. Here's a 69 uh, Corvette. Come on. <laughs> Pretty nice. Retro Racer. I don't know if the blue, red, and white are working on this one. I don't know why, but it's just not working. Here is the um, coupe clip in silver. Now, I just showed you a red one in the other video. If you haven't seen it, go check it out. Um, I think the red one is so much better than this. Now, granted, the red one, probably the paint chips, and that's what they were thinking, you know, banging against keys and stuff, and that's why they did a silver one. But I do believe the red one's better. This is a 76 Greenwood Corvette. Got it? Okay, look at that. This one's a pretty nice piece. It has a little detail on it, which is nice. Uh, this card is jacked on it, so MBD. Then look at this 67 Chevelle from last year. It looks like a sleeper baby, right? 
take those tampos off on the side and I think you got a pretty good race car on this one good old muscle speed graphics 8 of 10 did you buy all 8 10 of them I don't know this is a Ford Mustang Mach-E 1400 we saw this in the last video like I said I'd buy I'd be out there and I'd be like this is cool and I'm like shoot I already bought one <laughs> So, some of these might go back to the store. 87 Ford Sierra Cosworth. This one's, again, a nice one. A lot of graphics on it. Kind of old school, like retro. We saw one of these in the last, which is A-OK. -okay. I'm going to scoot these over a little bit and pull this row over. Now, here is the Diora 3, and this looks nothing like the Diora. I'm sorry, the original Diora by the Alexian Brothers, or Alexa Brothers, fantastic. One of my favorite original 1968 Hot Wheels, but this is the Getaway series. There's one in green and one in black. One is worth a gazillion dollars. <laughs> so, lucky, lucky. Then this one, I'm going along and did didn't even notice treasure hunt dude treasure hunt and ski on this pixel shaker now I think I left a bunch of these behind because I didn't know it was a treasure hunt so luckily for the next people behind me you know I don't take everything always you know so that is a good thing we're gonna put that one aside and put him with our other treasure hunts then I kept saw, seeing saw in this one <laughs> it's rescue Mercedes Benz Unimog 1300 this one is kind of cool now again the Unimog was a matchbox turquoise color with the orange uh, canopy back in the day right it's come a long way baby but this one's very cool in my eyes then I found this on the shelf, which was very interesting. A 50th anniversary Hot Wheel spec type. Again, it was on the shelf in 2022. And this one is from 2017. Came out in 2018. But this was on the shelf. So I don't know if this is like something someone bought and then returned or not but there was two of them and the twin mill has always been one of my favorites from the original now again the the more modern they get the goofier they get in my opinion this one's not bad but let me tell you those original ones very cool very simple very contemporary for its time then I found this, which is kind of fun, the Rocket Oil Special from the Art Car Series, one in orange and one in purple. And these are both from last year, but again, Art Cars, very fun. And especially 9 and 10, and 9 and 10 on those, you know, so that was a good find for me. We saw this McLaren in uh, one of the other videos. Again, I, I'm buying multiples of them, but uh, this one is definitely worth a second look. Retro Rods, if you don't have it, this is a good one for your collection, babies. And look at this Chevelle, 70 Chevelle. Now the graphics on it are kinda different for me. Contoured, and that's why. It's got body panels left and right, trying to bring the new kids, younger kids, into the old, our older generation cars. Oh, look at this. I don't even, I don't. Dave Ansonator. This is a race day car, all chromed out. Kind of goofy goober on this one. Look at that. So wild. So
some fun stuff. Again, McLaren, saw it, been there, done that. Don't need to do her again. Here's this Mickey Mouse Steamboat Willie. Now I know that you've all seen this one. This is a screen time, but very fun. Disney Steamboat. Look at that. Isn't that a riot? Just, again, something totally different and kind of fun to have. Then here's a Legends Tour Hot Wheel. Look at this. 70 Pontiac Firebird. Gorgeous. Dream Garage. Such an iconic car. Very cool in this one. Again, some nice detail. They did not totally go over the top. I did pick up three of those. Because again, American Muscle Cars, very cool. And this bus. I love the bus. Ain't fair. <laughs> Metro this is a really good piece. I like it. I don't know why Because it's got big but no um, <laughs> oh, Again just something really cool about that. It's got a bicycle on the front very fun and Here's our last row of Hot Wheels. Then we got a couple other uh, cars. This is a 76 Greenwood Corvette in a black where our other one was green see so again when you get the color variations very interesting I don't know if you know they just change your mind if it's different plants or what but and a 55 Chevy <laughs> this is just amazingly cool Clean, simple, gorgeous. 55, if I had a choice of 55 and 57, pick a 55 every day, then a 56. Here's 2JetZ again. We saw this one. Very fun little car. Digging that one. From the Rod Squad, and again, last year. Here's the... Alfa Romeo again. Gorgeous. This one, again, it reminds me of the Cheetah. And just a fun little car. I bet that zippity doo dah all day long on the track. Another one. Not a super duper or anything like that. So we can kind of push that aside. Here's a 57 Chevy Bel Air Gasser. In green. Again, this one gorgeous just real simple graphics like you're gonna hit the race on race day US dirty drag strip where the great ones 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 run 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 Chevy Bel Air very cool stuff on that I'm digging that here is your Ford Ford Focus RS in blue we showed you the orange one in the last video. These got separated. Brother and sister got separated at the mall. So, but again, Ford Focus, a great car. When you've got two different colors, I try and get both cars. Then, let me see. I'm going to do Matchbox next. So, uh, let's part the C's here. We'll push this to the side and this to the side. Clear off our deck. I found these. Now, what the heck are these? With a totally black background. I don't know anything about these black. It's for this year, 2021. Now I know they are putting out uh, treasure hunts in Matchbox series now and I just don't know what they are or is this a black card series or again if you know something about these let me know 
2015 Mercedes-Benz G500. Gorgeous, clean car. And it just has a Mercedes symbol on the front and back. But it's a black card. And I found two of them. So I had to buy them both. Then, this fire engine. Oh, so cool. Big Charlie told me about this one. Go check out Big Charlie's Model Garage. He showed a picture that he found this. And the next day I found it. And I'm like, cool. There was only one on the shelf. And I was very glad to get it. These retro uh, fire trucks, again, goes back to the good old days of Lesney. And then this one, a 2007 Honda, Honda Ridgeline. Isn't that nice? Again, orange. I like this one. Has a trailer pull, so you can pull whatever you need to pull with it. Isn't that nice? Ah, oh, so much fun. And this one was crazy. Self-driving bus. And that's where we're going. What was that? Total Recall where they had the self-driving Johnny cars. <laughs> or Johnny cabs. Right? <laughs> kind of goofy. Then here is... I've seen some of my friends find this and I agree. I found this about a month ago. 1960 Chevy El Camino. Look at the color combo and the body style on this. If you're over the age of 45, 50, you need one of these. Because this is so cool. Just color combo. Except that deck. Which is, you know what I mean. But everything else on that is just stunningly gorgeous then a Toyota MR2 now Soda Pop's roommate had an MR2 for a while which is cool and then I don't know what he, he got rid of it but very cool car I guess the parts are hard to get but again it's an MR2 Toyota so much fun Hey cats and kittens, it's a toy car case event at Johnny Roman's Supper Club. Oh, if this doesn't bring back memories, nothing will. We've got large scale Tonkas, Lament, Buddy L, and Ertl, and even plastic and tin toys, too! Woohoo! It is 316 on old Johnny Clark. Let's see what pulled into our parking lot. Then, the Land Cruiser 2020 uh, Land Rover Defender 90. Look, one in green and one in blue. I kind of like the green one. Now, my question is, why don't they make a Honda Element? They're making every other Honda on board, but they don't make a Honda Element. Is it because they've been out of production for so long? That, I don't know. So, Big Charlie set me onto these as well. And he gave me a loose one of these. And I am so glad because I want to keep these in the package. These shell uh, tractors are just fantastic. I wish they had a trailer combo with this. And maybe they do and I just don't know about it. But look how gorgeous that is. Now again, if you see a, a matchbox with a big circle M in the corner, that's like their treasure hunt. So look for that, that symbol on these cars. And you will have a treasure hunt. Here's a Curtis sports car. Now we've seen, and you will see in January, some Curtis, real Curtis cars at some car shows. And I'm, I'm showing some car shows in January and February. Just, you know, just some fun stuff when it's going to be cold as all get out here and Oh, Johnny doesn't want a video in the cold. <laughs> so, and I just want to think about summer. Now, here's a 70 Ford Capri. This is so retro for back in the day, the cars we would have as a matchbox. Right? I love this. This is metal parts. Piazzas, pieces, piacas. 
This is number two or 24. And here's all the other cars in that series. We got the MR2, which is nice. We didn't get the Volkswagen. I did. I don't know if I saw the Jeep or the Mini Cooper. And the 70 El Camino doesn't look too cool as that 59 El Camino. And then a bus. When it says Matchbox on the side, I always try and get it grilled to perfection. This is the Buffalo Burger. The Bison Bills Bison Burgers. Oh, kind of wild. Old food truck. Me and Mama someday, you never know. You might see us behind a food truck one day. Then I saw this at Jurassic Park. Jurassic World Ball, whatever they're called. Here's what they're called. The Gyrosphere. I know, it's so stupid. It's just like a big marble. But I had to get it. <laughs> There's so many other cars that could have been cool, but I got that one. So here's my Maestos. Look at this. Pretty sweet. I love the color on this exotic car. I have no idea what it is. Lamborghini, probably. It says it right there, but I'm not uh, reading it. Yeah, I think it's a Lamborghini. Right? I don't know. You guys know better than me. So, I, I'm going to be literally carried away by ants. <laughs> I spread the ant killer in here. <laughs> if I get a little lightheaded or goofy, you know it's the smell of the ant killer in, in the old supper club. Don't tell OSHA or the health department. They shut the supper club down in a heartbeat with all these ants in here. Look at this thing. So cool. Isn't that gorgeous? You can't beat this one. Only one I saw like this, so that was cool. Then this one. Look at this, 55 two-tone, just gorgeous. It's almost like a Foose design on there. That's how he would customize something like this, taking something old and making it contemporary, but still cool as all get out. <laughs> so there you go, there you got it. Oh, what do you think, guys and gals? Skirts and suits? Oh, there are some great fun cars in these. Oh, thanks for coming in to a toy car case event at Johnny Roman Supper Club. Sorry these are running long because there's just so many cars to show you. And we got so much more to show you. But we'll get to that soon. So, thanks for coming in. Remember, like and subscribe. Tell all your friends who are car enthusiasts and car lovers. And remember, it's for the adult diecast collector only. <laughs> So, till next time, my babies! Ha ha ha! Rock on, my babies! Rock on! There's Cheese Whiz for everyone at Christmas time! <laughs> it's not just for crackers! It's to spray straight in your mouth! Ah, uh, yeah! Plus, his gloves, my kinder! Oh, Santa Claus is coming to town! Oh, I love Santa Claus! You love Santa Claus? I love Santa Claus! You love Santa Claus? I love Santa Claus! Let's see what he does! <laughs> that guy needs a sedative! I know you're a toy car case guy out there. 
It is 316 on old Johnny Clark. Let's see what pulled into our parking lot. Hit that subscribe button and you won't miss out. Don't you wish you had that? This is the place to be!